Are you struggling to connect with your business? In this video, I'm going to talk about why you may feel disconnected from your business and what you can do to bring that connection back so that the spark returns to your relationship. So what do I mean by being connected from to your business or disconnected? Uh, you know, when you get that feeling, it's sort of like a push pull with your business. You know, there's times where you really wish it just didn't exist. And there are times you think, oh my gosh, I love being in business. I love having my own business. But it sort of goes up and down. And there are times you just want to bury your head in the sand or go back and get a full-time job. That's what I mean by feeling disconnected from your business. And so why does that happen? It's not dissimilar to a human relationship. It can happen when your business or you or both of you don't feel heard, don't feel supported. Okay? When you feel like you're just doing it on your own. And that can really bring about a feeling of disconnection from your business. And as your business is a separate energetic entity, it can feel the same way. And so it's like you and your business are operating on two very different wavelengths. And yet you need to be in a partnership. Okay? You think about it when you're out with a couple who maybe have had a bit of a fight or things are just, you can tell they're disconnected at the moment. The energy that the pair of them putting out is really not energy you want to be around. So this is how it is with your clients. If you and your business are disconnected, if you're not on the same wavelength, if you're not really loving and appreciating each other, the energy you're putting out to your clients is not really the right energy to attract the right clients into you. So connection with your business is vital. So what can you do? Well, one of the most important things is just recognizing your business is separate from you recognizing it is an entity that you're in relationship with. Yes, you created it, but it, you, once you created it, it became an entity and you are in relationship with it. So just recognizing this can be so helpful for your business. Another thing you can do is actually choose a symbol for your business that you can have on your desk something you really love and you feel very connected with, but it represents your business. So when you're working, it is there, separate from you, but connected to you because you love it. You love what it symbolizes. Okay, so it's almost like you then go into creating your work day and doing your work and seeing your clients together. So that's a second thing. And a third thing you can do is just a short visualization or a meditation before you start your work day and invite in the energy of your business. Invite it in, sit with it, commune with it if you wish, ask it questions, but just make time to have a little staff meeting before you start your day. And another thing that can be really helpful and quite cathartic is to actually write your business a letter. Write it, say what's frustrating you, say, share why you feel disconnected, share what you expect from the business that it's not giving you, but also share about why you love it. Okay? Your business also, it wants to feel loved, heard, connected. It, it wants to feel worthy. So just share all this in a letter and it will really bring a lot of clarity to you. It will bring, it will clear the energy and it will help nurture that relationship with your business. Bring back the spark. So I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. If you've ever experienced this feeling of disconnection, what you've done about it, and are you going to try any of those suggestions that I've made? The other thing you might love is uh, I have a visualization called Meet Your Business Visualization. It's available from my free library of visualizations. So I'll pop the link to that on my website here below this video, and you can listen to that. And you might like to use that regularly, or you might just make your own sort of shorter version uh, and use that daily with your business so that you can nurture that connection. 
So if you've enjoyed this video, please hit like. And if you hit the little notification bell, you'll get notified every week when I release a new video. Let's get you co-creating with your business. See you next time. Bye.